Hey guys, welcome to our shop tour. It's been probably what, like a month at least? I feel like it's like, we feel like it's been like two weeks and it's been three months sometimes. Either I have been shopping a lot for the store, which is probably true because it's spring or it's been a long time because I have tons of new stuff to show you guys. The gals at the shop are like, when are you gonna show all this stuff off? Um, we're super excited to be here today because we're also gonna be showing you our spring, uh, spring rain cell, spring, spring, spring cleaning, cell, spring cleaning, whatever. We have a ton of new items. We are not going to show all the new items in the cell collection because I literally did like four pages of items. <laughs> um, but if you go to the JRV cell collection, one of the pro tips I'm going to give you is search old to new because the way things work is if it's an older item that we listed a long time ago, it's going to be on the back pages. There's no way to like make the collection, the newest items posted in it. So We'd have to take it down and then yeah, redo the listing. Either go to the back pages and search or search old to new and you're going to find a lot of these items that we're going to show you. They are 30% off, no code needed. So it should show you the price of the item and the original price. So the price that it's showing you is the sale price. Um, and also what kind of lets you know is that um, I marked them at exactly 30. So the end numbers are not gonna end in 95. All of the newest items that I put in do not end in 95. So um, I'm gonna, we're gonna tell you what the regular price is because we don't have the math skills up here. And Maria just marked them 30% off. So we don't have the like sale price like on the actual item, if that makes sense. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. We'll show you what's for sale and then show you what's new. You can purchase anything at jamierayvintage.com. All right, so if you're coming in local and you're like, hey, I don't wanna hunt all over the whole store what's on sale, Maria and Kazaya pretty much know what it is and they can just show you what it is if you or ask. Or if you just have your phone, you can just go to the website on your phone and any item that's on sale on the website is also going to be on sale in the shop. Okay, I'm going to come stand up close so I'm not like five feet back here so you can see it good. We have a couple of these acrylic paint sets that are on sale that we've had these for a while so now. We moved these from the old shop. So the original price is $82.95 and you're going to get 30% off of the $82.95. They're original. They, they are really great acrylics i have used a set of these we still have some of them at the house they haven't gone bad they and they've been open a long time like they're a really good set of paint well and that one is plastic sealed so you don't have to we got this because we were, we were fancying ourselves uh canvas artists for a minute um and we played around with that for a minute but we've moved on <laughs> Jill says, thank you for her candle for her share gift you're welcome if you guys are on facebook remember to hit that share button it helps us out a ton and we pick two people every saturday um and send them something free in the mail it's a variety of items that we send we have a whole shelf of stuff that the gals send out and it's super fun all right next up this i'm actually kind of sad that we're not carrying this item anymore so everything that we're is in the sale collection is like not gonna when it's gone it's gone we're not gonna anymore so these ones are 1995 original price. I think I can do the math on this. They're going to be about six dollars off. Probably 1667. No, because it's 30. Yeah, oh. that's. I'm almost correct. Are you sure? Oh yes. And Kayla says if you don't email us your email when you win the share gift, we can't send you your gift. So always make sure you're emailing us. So cold for 24 hours, hot for 12. It's probably because I zoomed in real close. So we probably, I think we have four or five of these left. Some of these we only have a few yeah, of. Like some of them we have a bunch. Show you is actually something that we made. This is a unique handmade. Um, we had, I think we had four or five of them when we started. Oh, I can't even remember. Thirteen ninety seven. Kate, let's drop a link so I can see them. He has told you about six dollars off. <laughs> Um, but we, this is a one of a kind, unique handmade by Jamie and I, I cut these out and made them and then we painted them up fun. Um, this was originally 26 95, 30% off. These are cool because we, we intermittently can and cannot get these. Sometimes they're on back order, but we got so many the last time we still have a few left, but we actually painted ours on the front, on our front yeah, porch. So ours on our front porch, we painted it black. And we actually get our mail in it. We replace the the mail because we live in an older neighborhood. So they, the mailman comes up to our porch and we put this new uh, mailbox on their house. Yep. You can, you can do small letters or 
large, but larger parcels. Just it, like, yeah. Very seldom do they have to like just set something against the house. Originally, these were forty nine ninety five, less the thirty percent. So now uh, the the wall pocket Zeb showed the, with the pig on it is now eighteen eighty seven, and then the mailbox. I'll wait till Caitlin drops a link on that. I get bored. So we have a ton of these, um, and we have we've sold a ton of them. <laughs> but they're also a pain to ship. So sometimes when Jamie gets a bulk buy. She gets like a hundred of something. I feel like we've had a hundred of these because we still have quite a few. Uh, but these are their bag baguette board. But I feel like they're really fun to just put like tea lights on, or um, you could do a bunch of uh, like I think it would be cool to lay out like a bunch of muffins for something. I don't put, know. like a baguette on there, please. Jamie's like, please give me a French baguette. Uh, these... Vicky wants to know if the sun's even out here yet. It's 813. It's been out for a minute. So the, it's weird because we're on the backside of the mountains. And so it gets light in the morning. It's like a diffused light, but it doesn't come. It's it's like about seven o'clock where sunrise is, but it doesn't come up over the top of the mountain because the mountains are so tall and we're close enough to them that it shades us until probably about eight. <laughs> I just got one of our provincial stripe aprons that we put on sale that we don't have here, but we do have one more provincial stripe apron that has just been marked down. So good chopping Rhonda. So this is the last of the B. Those are tiny little bees on there. Uh, oven mitt. That one is also 30% off. Be amazing. And then... Oh, Lisa's shopping. We haven't showed this yet, and I don't even think we grabbed them. She grabbed one of our pig cutting boards, two of them. Oh, nice. Our silver platter. We only had one of those, so that was good. Is with the gold handles and some of our cast iron hooks that we showed you guys on Wednesday, Wednesday? Tuesday, Wednesday? Tuesday, Tuesday. No, Wednesday. 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 Yeah, Wednesday. Yeah. Two days ago. It's all by days are. That actually feels like a week ago right now. I know. It's we've had a lot of stuff going on. So Capri, lots of people ask, what does Capri look like? This is Capri. It's the milk paint color, and the color of the month for the milk paint is the best sale on that color. Usually, if we do a milk paint sale, it's only twenty percent off. But the color of the month is more. Yeah, so the color of the month is actually 35% off. So everything else we're showing you is 30% off, but the color of the month is 35% off. So Capri will actually be on sale only until the end of this month. Everything else we're showing you is going to be on sale until it's gone. It's final sale. Is this an animal set for sale? More. Yes, that was in the new to JRB collection or home decor collection. It's We've had it for a hot minute. So enamel set, I actually need something like this for camping yeah you, you, you <laughs> i was no i well i was looking i was looking through my camping stuff and i've got like a lot of like the pack packing like chintz like i don't want to say chintzy but they're like plastic yeah. for backpacking and i love cooking well, over an open flame because the original price and i think you could 95 so yeah that's good uh this is probably the cheap i don't even know why it was even as cheap as 22.95 but it's 30 percent off so it, or, Oh, 20. No, it's 29.95. So now it's 2027. Sorry, I got that wrong. 2027. You're going to get all of these pieces. So that's like an amazing deal because there's a lot of pieces of enamel. If you look at the listing, you can see all the things that are included. This is like Jamie's go to shirt for the last three years. Yes, my sister Deborah. She lost a button on shirt. one, I think, and was so mad. <laughs> uh, no, I look, no, I lost a button on the uh, that linen shirt. Uh, we don't even carry that. That linen shirt is so old. I think we've had it for like five. I've had it for like four or five years. So this is we about like purple. We used to sell this shirt. I don't know if we still have this shirt um, in stock, but a lot of my clothes either come from Costco or January Vintage because <laughs> I don't shop. You'll these probably ones. get a better pick of this with a with a mannequin or Jamie modeling or something. It's just a really flattering t-shirt. It's not tight on the bottom and the way it's cut kind of rests on your chest. So if you've got any kind of like mom belly, I've had five kids or just a burrito belly, it's like really <laughs> flattering. That's what I love. So that one's been marked down to 1887. That's actually one of probably one of my more favorite. These dresses. We got maxi dresses. Were not expensive to begin with. Um, and also there's limited sizes available on these guys. It's yeah, like whatever was too. left over, just not reordering them. So these maxi dresses, I think, were plus size originally. I don't know. This one's small. What size is this? This is an XL here. This is an XL. Wait. Um, yeah, I think so. Is it? No, that's small. Oh. So the one these, behind it's an XL. Sorry. <laughs> that's um, the tag I was 1995 for this dress originally. So you're saving an additional 30% off. 
So a gorgeous maxi dress with uh, pockets, friends. I know this is important to you when you have a dress. Not all of our dresses have them. With pockets, super soft, washes up well, and they've been marked down to $13.96. So if you need a maxi dress, definitely check out the listings. See what sizes we have left because we will not be recarrying. We might have more maxi dresses, just not those colors. All right. I... Oh, this is actually one of my, this is from last summer. You guys remember? This was like my go-to uniform. I still have one in my closet. Uh, $39.95 is the original price for this dress. So you're gonna save an additional 30% off of that. So that's like just less than $12 off of this particular dress. This is no also- needed. Everything's in the JRB sale collection. Be sure to search old to new and work your way backwards because a lot of the stuff is going to- I'll show this one close. It's got a lot of- Sorry, the sale collection, it's going to be uh, older. This there is you go. This is also her go-to, like, I think she's worn it to funerals yeah. and to church yeah, on- the back. So the, the front has the seam that goes like this, the lace, but then the back has an actual seam, which I do like because um, it kind of rests above your- your bum so it's a little bit more flattering i like to throw on a pair of biker shorts and i believe i did mark down some biker shorts um when i was marking things down we didn't grab all the sale yeah, items. jamie's life is way too shorts. active for that i have to have like i have to be able to do full ninja moves so when i wear dresses in the summer i wear biker shorts and then this one here it's almost got like a little swiss dot or something on it yep i think we're almost through what we're going to show you it's got an items. elastic band here in the middle be sure to check it out. Um, if they don't all sell out, then the next time we go live, we'll show you some different things. A little them. ruffle for you on the bottom. Yeah, this dress is really cute. Chicken. And that one is an extra large. So a lot of times our small and medium sizes are the ones left over because um, most people are not smalls and mediums. And But this one we have an extra large, so that's Oops. exciting. Okay, I think that's everything in the sale collection. Yeah, I do we have, want to move that over so we have more space. We have a, I'm going to move some of this off. Yeah, right yeah. now. I'm gonna right. put it on Thank the front desk. Sweetie. Okay, let's start showing the new to JRB stuff. There is still more stuff in the sale collection. That's just what we grabbed and showed you. Zeb has a twin in the camera. Oh, the the mirror behind us. That's funny. Yeah, there's way more stuff in the sale collection than that. But it was sprinkled all over and I couldn't find everything. The good news is that Maria and I know where most everything is in the shop. Okay, let's do the new to JRB. You guys ready? Um, these, the first time we came out with these quilts, they sold out like so fast. This time we have quite a few left. Um, I don't know if the post just didn't get us much reach or not. So I want to show you these. These are all one of a kind. I'm going to need you to stand up again. Oh, so I can show you're you. You're going to be, you're taller. I'm not tall enough to not drag the ground. So these are Cantha quilts. Um, they are made from vintage sari fabric from India. And they're two-sided. They're rather large. You can see Zeb's wingspan there. Uh, and they've got their hands stitched. I'll show this up. And they're us. different on either side. So when you look at the listing, it's the same quilt usually. Oh, it's gone blurry again, Zeb. All right. I don't know. Coming. Do you want to go to 5G from the Wi-Fi? I don't know what that'll do for it. Okay. It'll come back. Okay. It's back, kind of. Okay. So we also, some of these, I think it is used fabric. That the they're... one that Zeb showed is sold. Did it already sell? Or is that the one? We had that one order that was fraudulent. We'll have to double check. And we refunded. They patch them with little hearts from right. other quilts. So we won't show all of them, but there's one with a lavender side. Make sure you're checking both sides of them. This one is number three. It's lavender, so kind of a soft color on one side. And then you've got like the hot pink on the other. So this is the, the new for spring. New for spring. Um, this side is, this one's actually kind of cool. This is number two. Are you going to unfold all of these? Oh yeah, just a pillowcase <laughs> sold. Yeah, we're going to have to redo it. This one, look how neutral this is on this side. So you've got neutral on the front, boho party on the back. So these are all um, $79.95. This is number four. I'm going to kind of go a little fast because we only have about 30 minutes and then we've got to go <clears throat> because we have a meeting. So I want you guys to be able to see all of these ones. Caitlin, does Caitlin sleep? Sometimes, look, see neutral. Look how beautiful that neutral color. So this one is number four. 
This was number four. Zeb's holding him as I'm. Yeah. This is I'm the trying to keep up. Five like, I'm not going to show you all. The qu camp the quilts. Jamie's over here. I'm not going to show them all to you, but then she does. No, I said I was. Oh. <laughs> I said, I, well, I'm not going to like have you show them oh, all. Oh, fan them all out. This is number five. What I love about this one is the navy blue section. Let's see where I can. Look how pretty that is. And these aren't, they're not like a super heavy quilt. They're perfect for, I feel like they're, they're perfect for like the cool summer evenings. Okay, last one. This one is number six. Again, these are $79.95 hand stitched made from vintage shari fabric. So cute to like put on the back of your couch or to cover up. You know when you see a light blanket in the summer because the air conditioning or the the fan is on? Zeb doesn't understand that because he's never he's never uh, cool in the summer from if the, the air. If the fan's on and the AC set to 70, maybe I might need it. <laughs> Sorry, it's all the pollen in the air. He is always just a warm body and I'm always cold. So that's just the way that is. Okay, so we're gonna get moved to some other stuff. This next item, we had something similar before, but it was super spendy and I was able to source, oops, this is the spendy one. Let me get the less expensive one, hold on. She got the, she got the one that was more expensive. I was able to source it less expensive. So this, the previous set that we had was $49.95. The round dough cutter set is $24.95. So you can cut cookies or biscuits. It comes with three. I think the other one has more um, cutters in it, but this set is only um, $24.95, and I believe it has four different cutters. Comes with the ring. So if you love biscuit cutters, they're really good quality, and they cut your cookies, your biscuits, whatever you've got. So this is new because it's the less expensive one. Um, Vicki says, today's her hard day. She has a cor corporate job till 11. And then I have to, she has to flip two of her booths. Oh, that's going to be Ooh, That's a lot of work. Busy, busy. Okay. At next, least you get to start at 11 and not five though. Next up, this is actually a really good, so we sell enamel, which is spendy. You can search the word enamel and you're going to see a variety of prices. When it comes from England and France, big bucks. This is a reproduction, but it's a good one. So it's got rust on it it's not it doesn't look like somebody just took a marker to it have you seen that the cheap reproductions it's interesting it's enough though i was just looking at it the rust is under the glaze yeah no it's not like gonna continue to rust but it definitely looks old but it's new so this is 38.95 if this was from england or france it would be well over a hundred dollars so if you want the look for less this is new we've had the picture which we just restocked those but this is the um in picture with lid so it's a little bit different sty size and it's a little smaller than the big water pitcher that we have. $38.95 for this. Are those lightweight or heavyweight? Those are lightweight quilts. So lightweight. these are spring summer quilts. Not They don't have any batting. They're just the sari fabric. All right, Zeb, why don't you tell one of your favorite snacks? This isn't going to be in the new to JRV collection because we've had a Hammond's candy listing forever, but we added some new snacks to it. Six ounce Jordan almonds. I don't know what it is about these. I love crunching on them. I don't have them very often, but every now and then I'm like, they're mostly almonds. I can eat these. Uh, <laughs> but I, I don't know. It's There's just something about the texture. I could crunch them all day long. I don't even know how much these are. Oh, this is a six ounce. It's $9.95. And the Hammond's candy... Uh, they're like a hundred years of sweetness. They do a lot of like antique type candies too. Yeah, they've been making candy for a long time. Um, if you live somewhere hot, if you buy chocolate, just know that it could melt. It'll still taste the same when it gets to you, but it'll melt. Um, and then we have the gummy sour bears. Oh yes. So if you guys have booths or um, small boutiques like us, I highly suggest having candy. One, oh, you know what I forgot? The more popular one. This could also melt too, but this probably wouldn't matter. We'll put it in a sealed plastic bag so it doesn't get over anything else you ordered. This is our number one most popular candy right now. We can, <laughs> everybody's buying it every day. So the caramel marshmallow, um, I see when people come into the shop, we always, Jamie and I are always checking orders, seeing what people are buying so we can see what people like, right? 
Um, pretty much everyone throws a couple of these uh, onto their order when they walk in. <laughs> we had Tanea, one of our <clears throat> employees. She's now in college. She worked for us for a long time, and those she would buy one like every shift <laughs> were her favorite. She used her employee discount on the regular to buy them. They are very good. So um, just know that if you get candy and it's something that could melt, um, it it may melt when it gets to you. But we will put it in the little plastic baggie so that way it doesn't get all over. You can just peel it off. It'll still taste good. All right, next up. Um, we're, these are just a restock. We've been out of them for a while. We sell a ton of soap. So these are our enamel soap dishes. They're $14.95 each and we restocked the white and the aqua. This is, I have one of these next to my sink that I've had forever. We've got one in our shower. We keep one in the shower. They're nice because they let the, the water drain off of the soap and then it doesn't get all like that film all over your your shelf or your cabinet or whatever you've got it going on. And then it keeps the soap dried out so it doesn't get all mushy and wear out really fast. Vicky says the Andes candies are hot too. You know what? I should bring some Andes mints. You guys want to know my guilty pleasure? Um, I actually have a, a box. It's actually made for resale that I purchased online of Andes mints. It's this big and it's next to my bed and my nightstand. <laughs> Like who has 400 Andy's mints next to their bed? I do. I, I'm not a huge, I'm not, unlike Zeb, I'm like, a, I'll have one or two and I'm satisfied. So it's going to last me for a lifetime. So I probably should bring them to the shop because I don't know that I'll eat them before they go bad. But I was able to source it and I was like, that's coming home with me. And it's in my neck. I'm, I'm all or nothing with the sweets. So usually I'm nothing because <laughs> all is not good for me. <laughs> and Zeb doesn't like Andy's mints, so I don't have to worry. About? I love Andy's mints. Well, I thought you didn't love them. Maybe it's my mom. My mom doesn't like I mint chocolate. Them. I would go to Olive Garden specifically to get a mint at the end of the meal. Yeah, sometimes I've actually been known when we serve Italian food at the house to dip into my Andy's mint stash and put it on the counter so you get the full Olive Garden experience. Okay, we're going to have to move along here. I'm going to come close so I'm you can see the glass. chocolate that I don't even sell. <laughs> Okay, so this is jadeite glass. This is the Sunday dish. This is a bestseller for us and the particular manufacturer. Now, disclaimer, this jadeite is less expensive. It is not made in the USA like our um, Mosier glass jadeite, like the, the Gigi butter dish. The Gigi stuff has the Mosier molds and the uh, license to use those. The Fenton molds. So they're using Fenton molds. This is less expensive, <laughs> and I picked it up because I like to have high end, low end, right? So this is a little bit more manageable. The Sunday dish is twelve ninety five for this. So all reproduction, obviously, it's not antique jadeite. I love this sugar dish. I think that, that may be the last one of the sugar dish. Somebody came in the shop and bought one the other day. I do need to try to restock. It's the sugar shaker. Yeah, um, perfect for your cocoa or coffee bar. And I actually, this I think is going to be popular once we show it. I'm, I love these when you go to restaurants and you can have one in your own little coffee or... Uh, for like your sweet and low or whatever? Low, your, or just your sugar your packet? Stevia packets, if you're Debbie Beard, she loves Stevia. They're twelve ninety five, and it fits all the little packets in there if that's how you keep them. Or if you have an office that you want to make a cute cocoa or coffee bar at, that would be so cute to have that set up. Oops, this has the little, I'm going to have to put those back on. Keeps it from banging. Yeah, so we have the Geeky Butter Dish is like $36. How much is this butter dish? This one is $16.95. $16.95, you guys. This butter dish is a steal. It's a little mid-century modern. Do we have the Geeky one to show them I the difference? Two left. Maybe I need to put these. Uh, the Mosier glass is a little bit transparent, even like original jadeite. It's hand blown. So this is the high end. So this is, we have these and we have had them. They're not new, which is why they didn't make the showing. Um, but you can see the difference in the glass there. Still a fun design on this. It's kind of mid-mod on that. Oh, but I really yeah. love this. So would you get a business card and see, that's a good idea. Let's see if they fit business cards. That would be so cute. And this is only ten ninety five. I was wrong. I misspoke. Doesn't fit it like that. You, I would. You'd have to do them like this. Oh, okay. Like stack them in there thick and do them like that. Cute idea. So ten ninety five sugar packets and business cards. Look at Vicky coming up with all the ideas here. <laughs> Welcome. If you're just tuning in, I'm seeing a lot of new people popping on. Everything is available at jamierayvintage.com. Caitlin is dropping links if you're watching the live chat. Or you can check out the new to JRV collection or the JRV sale collection where you're going to find most of these items. 
Will tea bags fit in it? You know, I don't know. If the tea bag is the same size as a sugar packet, then the answer would be yes. You can only just go the opposite direction like Zeb did with business cards. Salt and pepper. This so, is a set. Yeah, at one point I had just salt because I thought I'd order pepper and I didn't because I have to buy them individually. But now we've got both and they're a set. This is the large set, so it's more expensive as the price on that one. This is my size for the salt, unless you're using like French salt. Zeb, what's the price on those? Uh, twenty three ninety five for the set. And these are a little bit more opaque, um, like the other glass, and or no, translucent. And then this salt and sugar set is more not translucent. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. Okay, so it is eighteen ninety five. Eighteen ninety five for the smaller set. And I guess I said mid mod on this. I think this is more of like Art Deco. Kind of retro. And this I think would match it really well. Yeah, those are the same. And you can show them the difference in size between this, the Mamma Jamma, like, you probably are never going to have to refill this, and these are your, you might have to refill more often. Well, I don't know about never. Maybe on the pepper. Uh, pepper, that's a lifetime supply of pepper. I love pepper. It's not a lifetime supply of pepper for me. Okay, and then we have this. I know we're showing lots of glass. We're, this, um, is the last time. this is the mixing bowl. This one is thirty two ninety five. All right, let's let's mix it up after the mixing bowl. It's getting blurry again. I don't know. I don't know what the half the screen. See if that makes a difference. I don't know if it's like. No, it just wants me to add stuff. It's clear up here. Maybe it's just that. Maybe it's just a computer. Yeah. Okay. Well, hopefully it fixes itself soon. Somebody sent us a mad face. It always come back. It's the connection, not the camera. Zeb, can you get on foot? Uh, I'll try it. I'll try it real quick. Hopefully we don't lose the well, screen. It's kind of hard. If it's blurry, it doesn't work well for showing. Here we go. Now, did we reset? Let's see. Well, we're, 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 we're Yes, we are better. Okay. We're not Sorry, there. guys. We switched from, we can't do this at home, but. Since we're streaming from our phone, we switched from uh, Wi-Fi to 5G. All right, let's talk soap. We have our French soap. I'm going to keep showing close. But this soap not only smells good, and it, but it's beautiful. And we just restocked the Finchberry soap. It's artisan soap um, from Gainesville, I think, Ohio, made in the USA. And you get a Finchberry rubber band with it. <laughs> it smells delicious. So can you tell them the names? This is called Tart Me Up. So yeah. It's kind of a tart scent. This is uh, really? Darling. To me, it looks kind of like... It's like, like all a, sparkly on the top. A unicorn ice cream sundae. This one is called Spark. So these, you know, you can obviously use them, but they're mostly for beauty. Renegade Honey. We actually have used these. These are very and, heavily scented. I'm and sure. they do wash you up pretty good. And then we only have a, two of these left. The Grapes of Bath. This one is probably our most popular in store. Um, but these are really fun. This Too bad you don't have smell-o-vision. They yeah. smell so good. And then we have these new loofahs. This is like a, like a rubber band material almost. $7.95 and it's got lace on it. So not only is a loofah, but it's pretty. It's got a lacy edge and it's $7.95. I gotta get a drink of water, so I'm gonna let Zeb. Okay, I'm gonna show you this. <laughs> I got like a Speck of dust so this is like a big seated uh I, I we would use this as a large vase jamie likes to get a couple dozen roses from costco and she'll drop them in there and then she'll rotate them around sometimes there's baby's breath sometimes there's not so these are antique pickling jars from europe they are seated um, and we have one blue and one clear left the clear is less expensive i think it's like 20 bucks less can you look at the price of this one this one is 79.95 and they do have down on the bottom. I don't know if the camera's picking that up. This is a uh, three liter is what it looks yeah, like. And they're just beautiful. So we, have, and these are like unique items. So some of the new to JRV. I would items, say that that's more than three. I have a company that picks in Europe for me and that's where that came from. Okay, these are not actually old. These are made to look old. They did a really good job making them look old. They do have crazing in the glass. Um, this is, I believe, under the glaze. Not 100% on that, but looks like it's pretty durable. Let's see, people are buying. We're out of the Provincial Stripe apron that we haven't even sold yet. We have a couple more of the delicate black dress with um, lace. We're out of the pomegranate brass bowl. 
So make sure you guys are checking the sale collection because things are going fast. These, what I so love these are these are, are thirty one ninety five. They're iron stone Crocs. They have cracks in the glazing, and so they look old. But instead of being two hundred dollars for this giant size, it's like thirty. So this one, this one is twenty six. This one's thirty one ninety five. Thirty one is the newest. Some of them we have had before. And then this one, the short one, is twenty twenty dollars and ninety five cents. CJ, I'm not sure. Uh, whatever the picture shows, that's what the item is. It's possible the description might be incorrect. Um, so the, this, so this is acrylic. I was just saying, this looks like glass, but it's acrylic. So if you have kids that you don't want, to if you're feeling them. fancy for your cereal in the morning, you know you got to get your you got to get your uh, Fruit Loops going in the morning, and you want to see them through the bowl. <laughs> oh, these are only four ninety five. These Thank you. These are only four ninety five. Four ninety five for these bowls, and they are acrylic. I know they're going to read as glass on camera, but they're not. They're just really good. Okay. New, we're not going to show all of them, but we do carry Bentley seeds. Some of them are heirloom. Some of them are um, open pollinated. Yeah. And we are carrying more flowers. So I'll just read these quickly. They're all variants. It's what we use when we're planting our garden, what's going to be happening in a few weeks. Um, lavender, zinnias, chamomile, baby snapdragons, of course, sunflowers. Wildflower mix. This is one that's going to be really popular. You're like me mix. and just don't really want to plant out a garden. Just like mix this with some dirt, sprinkle it around. I'm going to be out at the property dancing around like the sound of music, just throwing flowers. Wildflowers are very good at just reseeding themselves every year. More sunflowers. And then we have, what are these ones? Oh, a different kind of wildflower. So the wildflowers, I believe it shows you what region of the United States they're from. Uh, the what does it say? Western. Look at the bottom. Look at yeah. The, no, this is a see, Western mix. So you can see. Do I have any lufa seeds? I don't. I'll look and see if they carry them. So we have several different wildflower types, and it shows you on the map. So when you're shopping, look on your map uh, for what the region is, and that'll show you where where it would uh, grow well. All of our seeds are made in the USA by Bentley. Um, they've been around for a long time, and we can attest to we use them they grow and every customer that's purchased them has had good things to say about them and if you don't know that about seeds there are some brands that are just not great at coming up these are pretty darn good well Forget even the sunflowers we grew a bunch of them last year here at the the uh, shop and then jack and i planted hundreds out at the property from the seeds that fell from the ones that grew last year, and those are coming up right now. If you buy heirloom seeds, you can take the seeds from the plant and reseed them. So that's we don't have water at the property. That's just from like rain and snow. Yep. <laughs> We've got forget me nots, uh, morning glory, and then marigold. So all really good seeds. If you're getting ready to start getting your seeds, throw these on. They're um, two something 229 a package so they're a great add-on item and then last but not least um this is not going to be in the new to jrv collection because we've carried these for a while but we've got north shore is our newest scent from antique candle company if you don't know about antique candle company they are hand poured in i think it's indiana i gotta look in here uh i guess i have to find a bigger jar but they're hand poured in oh lafayette indiana yeah. they're non-toxic clean burning sustainable materials so the scents are not toxic soy based candle wicks all the things you want we carry this little two ounce jar is 9.95 or you can get the larger jars um but if you don't know for sure you want a scent you can try the smaller ones and then these are the melts so these are 18.95 and if you saw our video not too long ago we melted these down and we made our own candles in um, vintage vessels. So that's kind of a fun little project you can do. And one of the things that people mess up the most with when they're making their own candles is adding the scent. Because if yeah. you add too much, this the candle won't be good. If you add too little, it won't smell good. It's nice to buy these wax melts because they're already pre-made. You just have to melt them down, pour them in with your um, cotton wick, and they, they're very user-friendly. Okay, thanks for sharing, Susan. All right. Um, we, we have eight minutes. All I right. want to do just a quick pan and walk okay. around and show them the shop. Not a ton has changed since the last time we did a walk well, around. That's a new display. Because we were there. getting ready for spring the last time around. But let's just show them because it's fun to I'll see put the some shop. Things back. So let's show them our main seasonal display. I'll put these back. Okay. I want to show them your violin. We are going flying. 
Show them how we, we just staged The violin it. just got staged up right here. You can't even tell it's broke until you get close and really investigate it. <laughs> I don't want you to think it's not broken because it is. We got our chippy peak candles. We like to mix old and new in our displays here at the shop. I'll try to try to walk slow-ish. We got rid of one easel. We had two here because we moved this in. I think that's been like that for a while. Um, this big mirror is on here right now. Occasionally we swap it out, but um, I think the mirror is here because it's waiting for the right person. It is four ninety nine ninety five online. It's less expensive. Yeah, the shop because it's going to cost. And Keep that in mind if you're local and you come in the shop. Some things are less in shop because we don't have to ship the them. Furniture, the big clocks. This is the clear pickling jar. Um, I'm going to. That's the clear one and, and the sheep. Okay, these are all the soaps Jamie was talking about. Um, this is kind of our beauty display. We do still have the JRV beauty line. Uh, Jamie uses all this stuff at home. I can't say that I use it, although I do use the counting sheep because it's like an excellent salve. Um, I use that on like uh, like cuts and scrapes and things. Um, you use some of the products we sell. Zev just uses our bar soap. Oh, yes. I don't use bar soap. No, I'm talking about these ones. Yeah, the JRV Beauty is my exclusive. I don't use those much. That's my exclusive skincare line of what I use. I'm particular about what goes on my face. This is the bar soap I use pretty much every day. No, Zeb's not wearing his Invisalign. He does, he has um, caps now. No, yeah, I'm done with that. I wear a retainer at night, but. So here's our display. We have quite a few of the antique candle company scents. We try to. We really love this company. It's people come in specifically for Antique Candle Co. And also our gray sack fabric. Like these are two items that uh, there aren't a lot of boutiques in the area. I don't think they carry these. So if you guys are boutique owners or you have a vintage booth, really try to find unique things that people can come specifically to you for. And these are definitely it for us. All right, let's pan this side. Just show you, this is kind of like the entryway display. It's looking very spring. We've moved things around, changed some things. These fruits, I'm actually shocked that this is our hands down most popular one. This is, oh, it's not pressed. I think this one is $39.95. Oh, we are sold out of our kitchen soap, but you know what? I have more. I just need to put it in the container. So if somebody wants that, email info at jamierayvintage.com and it will motivate me to get my work done. I just need to put it in the vessels. And this is the girl. She's on. She's on canvas. That one's on rice paper. Yeah, this one is also thirty nine ninety five. This this is going to be in the thrift haul collection. So anything that's unique is going to be in the thrift haul collection. I'm just kind of panning slow so they can take it all in, all the eye candy. Yeah, but it's a good mix of new and old. Like these are mass produced. These are mass produced. Everything else is vintage and found, except for the spode cake plate here and maria and kasaya do just such an amazing job i don't know why this is backwards uh mixing it all together fun spring trunk that's last release isn't it for the iron orchid designs yes i that's elysium is the transfer on that let me pull up comments i don't know why it's not we'll take a we'll take a run through here and then i don't have time to show you the whole shop and and walk you through so we're gonna show you the seeds here because we have a lot more than just wildflower seeds. We have something I want to show. We have your whole garden here for you. So I'm not sure we've shown these before. This is a table runner. It is 90 inches long. It is seven dollars and ninety-five cents. It's a great neutral. You can see that we've got it here. It's like an olive gray color. So if you need an inexpensive table runner, this is the Julie Olive Plaid Table Runner, 13, 90, 13 by 90. Such a good deal. Like, you're definitely going to want to pick those up. I think once I show them, so you want to show them this on the screen, yep. that people are probably going to pick them up. All right, two more things. The bookcase that we did a little while back. I'm actually shocked that it hasn't it's, sold. It sells a lot of books, though. People buy books off of it all the time. It, look how many books this bookcase holds. So if you're wanting this bookcase to be shipped, it's seven ninety nine ninety five because it's got to be shipped to be a courier. But it holds a ton of books, and it looks amazing with all of our Reader's Digest books. And then, last but not least, I wanted to show you my clocks. And the big mirror. Let me shut this all the way. 
So I got my clocks up there. They're not, I, I, I wasn't worried about doing them equal or even because I'm probably going to keep going up. <laughs> I want to fill the whole wall up. Jamie's like, stop buying clocks if we did that real. And in my mind, I'm like, hey, 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 hey. At least one more. Yeah. Well, I have this square one over here that I put on this wall, but I'm I'm still, I, don't, don't you stress. I'm going to get more clocks because if no one else buys them, I think they'll look cool for display. Super spendy for us when we're like buying them secondhand. Yeah, most of those I get for fifteen they're bucks. They're just very expensive to ship, and they take a long time to paint. Um, so it's not like a ton of money out of our pocket, just time. So um, also we've got this big mirror. This was one of our more popular uh, waste not Wednesdays. This mirror is nine hundred ninety nine dollars to ship. You can see it's larger than I am. If you're local though, it's three ninety five because. This has to be shipped via courier. We cannot just package it up. And if you saw our Waste Not Wednesday window that we did the new transfer on, that already sold and it's being shipped out. So that was a fast sell on that one. All right, guys. I think that's it for today. Yeah. Thanks for following along with us and for being here on our live video. I know when we're in the shop, the quality kind of goes in and out. So I will try next week to include a shop tour at the end of a video that we can do edited. Um, and if you want to shop, everything's at jamierayvintage.com. Be sure to check out JRV sale, new to, new to sale, and then our thrift haul collection. And we also have a home decor collection. So if you ever want to see um, our items that we carry that are not thrifted, that's going to be at home decor and then obviously clothes too. And, and paint and products, we've got all the things. We need you all to email Lehigh City and tell them to get fiber down our roads so that we can switch our internet. Yeah, we pay for the most expensive internet, so this is as good as it gets for now. <laughs> but we'd love fiber. If you like this video, please hit share, give us a thumbs up, and subscribe to Jamie Ray Vintage for more. DIY. We'll see you guys on the next episode. Love you guys. Catch you guys later.